Good morning, I'm Dr. Duke Major. I'm here with one of my patients who's traveled from out of town to Duke Spine Institute. And what brought you down to Duke Spine Institute here in Florida? Pain. Pain, all right. Pain. <laughs> Where was your pain? Pain was in, um, I would say, in the middle of my uh, lumbar region of my back, the lower back, mm -hmm. and shot down the backs of the legs, even down as far as the outside of my right uh, calf and a little bit on the top of my right foot. <laughs> yeah, and before surgery, before you came here, you were walking around kind of hunched forward, <laughs> oh, right? Boy. Yeah, I, I was in this uh, shopping cart uh, position, which I came to know is diagnostic of my problem. Yeah, well, yeah. spinal stenosis. Yeah. And so, w just a minute ago, you said uh, you had pain. Does that mean that your pain is now gone? Oh, I only feel a little bit kind of, I can tell that something was done inside there but it's in the zero to one range yeah so the pain you're feeling is because we had to make a little incision and put that endoscopic tube down so you're feeling the discomfort from the tube being put in but the disc pain from the herniated bulging disc that you came here with that pain you had in your disc what do you say about that <laughs> miraculously gone gone cured <laughs> oh, so unfortunately there are millions of people yeah. living out there with back pain every day like you had who's to who are totally debilitated and can't do anything normal because of it and they are being told by their doctors and the people around them it can't be fixed do you agree with that that it can't be fixed no i i, I think it, there's a good solution right here and the solution offered to me by a couple of pretty good neurosurgeons was to to do a big time open back surgery that would have laid me up for a while and bad drugs and all all that kind of hospital stuff. Yeah. So did you go to the hospital for the Duke laser disc repair? No, I went to a friendly clinic. There you go, we outpatient. And did you um, did you get laid up after the surgery you had yesterday? No. <laughs> and did, are you on big nasty drugs right now? <laughs> no. Yeah, that's, those are some of the important distinctions. The Duke laser disc repair is done with a seven millimeter incision and there's no nasty drugs. It's just basically Tylenol or an anti-inflammatory. All right, so what are you gonna do now that your back is fixed after you wait for it to heal completely? What are you gonna start doing? How does it change your life? Mm. Yeah, it's gonna allow me to do all, I, I'm assuming it's gonna allow me to do all the things I I've loved to do in recent years. I'm a uh, furniture maker and a cabinet builder, and um, hoping to get back to that. Maybe I can even take care of the woods where there are some big trees about to fall on our lane. Because I used to do a lot of, I was like a logger in a way, chainsaw and all that stuff. So I'm gonna ease towards that. You all are gonna tell me how mm. to approach any such thing. Yeah. <laughs> We've cured your pain, but your disc is not yet completely healed, and it takes time to heal, about a year to completely heal. So I want you to gradually get back into the kind of heavy things. Um, anything else you want to tell us before we wrap this up? I would just say to folks out there suffering, um, consider this alternative. This could really be this could give you a new lease on life and it wouldn't put you in a hospital and make you take opioids to fight the pain for who knows how long. So I'm just grateful to have found this alternative with Duke Spine Institute. We're grateful that you're here and now that you're fixed and you're cured and I expect your back and leg pain to be gone for the rest of your life. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. Yeah.